Hi, in this video I'll explain how to use Blender's internal video editor to render multiple scenes in 5 minutes. Let's get to it. I have the scene set up that has 8 scenes to be total and there's a dog taking selfies in front of these landmarks. So first step is to create a new scene. You click this new scene button and click on new. So now you have this blank scene that uh, doesn't have anything. So step two, click on this plus icon that over it says add workspace. These are the workspaces and you click on add new workspace and navigate to video editing and video editing. All right, step two is done. So you'll notice this is the preview pane and this is the sequence editor. So step three, now you'll notice there's a add button or if you hit shift A like you would do it anywhere in Blender and you'll get navigate to scenes and you'll notice that I have all my scenes listed down here. I'll click one of them and it is placed. So you'll see my, the preview here. So there is a problem. I mean, why is this blank area on the sides? Um, this happened because the scene format setting, the resolution, is doesn't match with my scenes, the other scenes. So to fix that, I'll hit Control C and just move, and I'll add, I'll match the resolution, to my scenes. So there's this format preset. I'll see if I, there is any setting in there. I not. What I'll do is. Uh, add my resolution just 1080 by 1950 and it matches with the resolution scene. So I'll add the scene again and it's perfect. So for a test, what I'll do is I'll hit render and see what happens. Alright, so my scene is rendered and there is an issue over here. I need to fix that later. So uh, it is rendered perfectly, that's my render setting and everything, so that's great. What I'll do next is add my cursor at the end of this scene, shift A, add the second scene, and one second adds, and perfect. Good. Add the next scene here, I'll just play it here. Let's see. Okay, perfect. So, for this example, I'll just render these three, right? Alright, so the scenes fit perfectly, and I assume my render settings are okay. Apart from them, well, which I'll fix later. So, what I'll do is adjust the start and end to match with the sequences I have and adjust the output folder and hit render animation so there you have it that was my method render multiple scenes so um if you have any other questions uh, let me know in the comments uh, thank you so much for watching and please hit like and subscribe thank you